It all starts with this powder, metal that's been ground to fine dust. The machine then turns the metal powder into something else, such as tools or components for other machinery. This time, the metallic powder will be turned into a mold used to produce plastic parts. How long will that take? These two components will be ready in 48 hours. The metal is melted layer by layer. It's precision work done with a laser. Slowly, the mold takes shape. The process is called selective laser melting and it's used by the tool craft company in Bavaria to produce made-to-order components like this one, which is specially designed to stay cool during operation. Christoph Hauck is an assistant manager at Toolcraft. As you can see, it looks quite ordinary from the outside, but inside there's a complex cooling system. We can produce geometric shapes that can't be made with other technologies. For the design engineers, laser melting technology offers new possibilities. Now they can create three-dimensional shapes that can't be produced with conventional equipment. Christoph Hauck is ordering more new laser melting machines. They start at 400,000 euros. And those with additional functions can cost twice as much. We're looking into it right now, and the next machine will probably arrive here in about three to six months. This is a technology with a good future ahead of it. That's music to Torsten Herbert's ears. He works for the company that produces laser melting machines. 2012 was our best year so far. We sold somewhere upwards of 50 machines. We're getting orders from many different sectors, aviation, medicine, dentistry, the automotive industry. Many companies are experimenting with new shapes and designs, all made out of powder. The component with the built-in cooling channels is almost done. The leftover powder can be reused. This part will get a few more enhancements, then it will be shipped to the customer. Soon it will be used to mold plastic bottle caps. Christoph Hauck is planning to expand operations here. We're putting up a new building right here, made out of metal and glass. The building will contain more laser melting workstations. We'll also buy more laser melting machines, which we'll install here. So it's a major investment. Several million euros. Hauk will invest about 4 million euros in laser melting. He's convinced it's the technology of the future.